Good afternoon, y'all. I'm Kyle of Photos World, and today we're going to take a look at our new 2023 Robala 266 Sky Deck. First thing I'm going to go over is our trolling motor. We have a Men Coder Riptide Tarova 36 volt 72 inch shaft trolling motor to get you out in the water, get you to this fishing spots. Um, the next thing I'm going to go over is the deck. The bow deck has stainless steel flush mounted hinges where you'll be able to walk over all over the, the front deck and have you know not trip over anything anything like that next thing we're gonna go over is our anchor box this is where we're gonna house our anchor it has the clips to lock in your anchor second thing i'm gonna go over over here is a 25 gallon live well it's gonna be able to house all your green bags uh pinfish anything like that next thing we're gonna go over is our front bow seating uh, there are storage under all these here. So our first storage is going to be for our rod locker. It's going to house three rods. Look at all that space there. You're going to have rods, you're going to have all kind of tackle, all that good stuff. Our next one is basically going to be a fish box. This next one right here will be able to house all kind of fish. You got snap or anything like that. It's got a drain. You can use it as a cooler as well. We also have storage down here. You better, that's where you put your base, your seat, everything out. All right, we also have storage underneath the seat here. You just pull this cushion off, you open this latch. You can have storage up here. Underneath is where you're gonna put your trolling motor batteries. That's your trolling motor charger. So this is gonna be able to charge. You have a port on the underside here. That's gonna be able to charge your trolling motor. Next thing we're gonna go through, let me put this back here is your head. This has one of the largest heads on a boat. It houses your toilet, so if you have, you know, your wife, your kids, grandkids, if they need to use the bathroom, this is right here is going to be the perfect thing for them on the water. A lot of people when they're looking for a boat, they're looking for a boat that's going to have a head for situations like that. On the helm of the boat right here, what we have, we have a Simrad 12 inch on the dash that's so going to be able to read all your gauges, going to be able to read your GPS, it's going to be able to read everything that you're going to need. The Helm also has a wireless phone charger, so if you want to charge your phone, and it's something that can actually hold your phone if you're hitting rough waves, that's where you're going to really grip your phone so it doesn't go anywhere. You have your electronic trim tabs, and your steering and your, your throttle are both electric, so it's very smooth. You've got enough power to get you up on plane. Um, turning is just like butter. All the seats in Robalos are all silicone made, so there's you cannot get any kind of mildew on these kind of seats. Um, they're very plush, nice. I love the color of this boat. Um, so we can work our way to the back of the boat here. Um, you have your jump seat. What's amazing about these boats is they've got very large jump seats. You can easily fit three people here. Um, if not, you want to do some fishing, all you do is lay it down, and there it is. Enough fishing for the whole family. Um, you're going to have two 30-gallon live wells. They have all the lights that lights up everything. Um, you'll be able to, you know, between you and your buddy, throw a black them out, you'll be fishing all day. Um, this will be the second one here. If you ever wanted to, if you ever had to, work on any of the bilge pumps or anything like that, it's very easy and accessible with these Rebalos. They make it so nice where you get in there, you get to change a fuel water separator, anything like that. It's so super nice. Um, this boat is also equipped with a 10 foot power pole. Um, once you get it to the sandbar and you want to beach up, something like that, that boat or that that power pole right there is definitely going to get you, you know, in the spot. There's two swim platform pods on the back, one with the ladder, so it makes it very easy and accessible to get in the boat. There is a 10 inch jack plate on the boat as well, and uh, you know, kind of gets you a little better more performance. We also have storage for your, your cast net. Um, there's bucket storage in either side. Bring a bucket in there, or if you want to put your, your you know, bait well bucket, you definitely can. Makes it very easy and accessible. We also do have a raw water and a fresh water wash down. Very accessible in the back. You know, you just get your hose hooked up to it and you spray everything down. Um, that's it for the back of the boat. Meet me at the top of the boat. All right guys, so this is the upper half of the drive station. And what you're gonna have up here is you're gonna have a nine inch Simrad that sits up here. It's gonna help you do all your navigation and everything like that. Um, your second digital throttle 
So all you do is hit a button and all everything transfers up to here. And you're gonna have your still electric steering here. Um, you'll still be able to, all your controls for your jack plate. You gotta still have to make sure you're wearing that your, your lanyard. Um, up here, it's just very nice to be able to see all the fish schooling up, be able to see if you're in short, shallow water. It's very comfortable. You have four rod holders up here as well, so you're gonna house as many rods as you need. All right, guys, this was the Revala 266 Skydeck. Now, let's go run it.